Hello everyone, today we're gonna play Mon Cards. I have no idea what this is about. It's supposed to be a short story game, so let's go! What is happening? <laughs> Part 1 Understandings. What? Who is that guy? Why is there an elephant? Why is there a monster? So you're here. You've come all this way. Enticed by all the rumors, weren't you? You had to come check this out for yourself, just like all the rest. Well, what they say is true. If you play a game of mon cards with me and beat me, then you will indeed receive what you are seeking. What am I seeking? I don't trust this guy. Dot dot dot. He, 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 he. But it's not that simple, no. There's more to it than that. I wouldn't be giving it out for free, for nothing. Now would I? Of course not. I'm not stupid. You get your chance at a reward if you win. So of course in the same way I shoot too. It's only fair, right? For what I'm offering, there's only one thing you have that's equal in value. Dot dot dot. You! Me? If you lose, I get you. You're mine. For the rest of your life, I'm not being greedy. It's only fair. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, you can't back out now. Once you've sat down with me, it's started. The bet is on. Ah, I don't want to. I want to go. Oh. Trying to leave now would count as a forfeit on your behalf. So you might as well just play and lose. Might as well have a bit of excitement and drama. Eh? Eh? Canadian guy. Dot dot dot. Wait. Hehe. <laughs> you don't even know the rules, do you? I can see it in your eyes. I can smell your anxiety. Hehe. <laughs> well, I'm feeling nice and considerate at this moment. I'll simplify the rules for the first round. We'll play three card giraffe mond. But there's an elephant. The easiest version of the game. So simple that even toddlers can understand it. I don't feel like explaining all the rules, so I'll just give you the most basic ones and you have to figure the rest out. So, when we begin, you draw three cards. Between them, pick the most strategically, strategically viable card. And repeat. I do the same. Neither of us see... But... Ah! I couldn't even read it. Then once all our cards are chosen, we enforce the jewelry state, ready the dimples, look for any piff crimples, and if any are spotted, we act accordingly, obviously. Then whoever's cards come out on top wins. Ready? <laughs> dot dot dot. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I say that you're ready whether you think are or not. Heart. Wait, what? This one. Hey cutie pie, cutie patootie, that's you. You're so hot. Hope you'll be staying with us. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's it. Dot dot dot. Let's keep in touch. Talk to you soon, sugar dumpling. <laughs> oh, kisses. Oh hoo hoo. Psst. Dot dot dot. Ooh. Dot dot dot. What? Because you're stupid, I'll go over the rules again. Three cards, pick one, discard the other two. Repeat two more times. Get it? Okay, let's begin in. Three, two, one. Done. Well, it looks like you lost. Big surprise there. What? You performed admirably, though. I'm very surprised by your skills. I was expecting much work from you. Thanks? Actually, I'm just joking. You performed exactly as pathetic as I expected. Hee <laughs> hee. First round is over. Looks like this will be very easy for me, as always. You're the same as all the rest. You come here thinking you'll get exactly what you want, that you'll be special. But the truth is, you can never have what you want, not here, la la la. Ah, why I will do that? The best you can do is stop wanting. To be happy, you have to align what you desire with what is. Ooh, deep. Therefore, you'll have to work on being happy to live in servitude to me. There's not much else you'll be able to do. 
Either accept that you are lowly and subservient to me, or be miserable for no purpose. Your misery will get you nowhere. First round lost. End of part one. Aw, we lost. Oh, there's a part two? Okay, let's play. Hopelessness. Let's talk to this guy. Hmm. Thinking of you, babe. Can't wait to- <laughs> The anticipation is killing me. I'm not a very patient person. But at least when you're mine, then you're mine forever. You're gonna be my for- <laughs> I'll take her your insight with my greed. What? <laughs> Love you, Pootie Pie. Love you, Snoogles. Love you. No, I don't want to lose. Psst. Ooh. Okay. Maybe I'll get you working in the mun mines, force you into manual labor, binding for mun manuals. It's a commodity in high demand, unfortunately. I control all of it. A single ounce of it costs more than the life of most people. But I get to use as much as I want for anything I want, making my personal living estate worth more than several first world countries put together. I bet you didn't even notice. Seeing as how you're uneducated, uncultured, and unsophisticated, but the deck of cards we're playing with are made entirely from mud minerals. Or maybe I'll even put you in the sunroom! Oh god, not the sunroom! You must be thinking to yourself, hee <laughs> hee! I know you're thinking, oh Jesus, no! How can he be that cruel that he'd put me in the sunroom? I can send your internal resistance, but it won't do you any good when you're under my control. <laughs> People and animals with eyes are so weak and stupid. Only the eyeless can understand anything worthwhile. Whoa, that's deep. Only mindless idiotic chatter will exist in those with eyes. Those without can effortlessly understand the vast so-called mysteries of the universe. That's why I'm strong and you're weak and pathetic and stupid and lame. Ones with eyes such as yourself can never be on the same level as the master beings. As you can see, I don't even have eye sockets. My front cranial anomaly grants me my wondrous power that's so great only I can fully understand its depth. Damn, you are so stupid. Let me give you some trivia. And I'm sure that you're so ignorant that you won't know any of this. <laughs> I cry every time. <laughs> okay, I'll give you three pieces of painfully easy trivia that you won't know. Just to make you realize how idiotic you really are. First, my name is Love, spelled backwards. Evil. You're so stupid that you haven't figured that out yet. The combined total number of teeth of everyone in this room is 64. Okay, why, why do I need to know this? Only an idiot such as you wouldn't know that one. And finally, despite common thought. Huh? What? A hundred meters is actually equal to one centimeter. The fact that you didn't know that one is especially pathetic. Now maybe finally you can start to grasp my superior intelligence. Dot dot dot. Hee hee hee. This time we're not playing with the little kitty rules anymore. We're playing with standard 10 card turnip month cards rules. Diamonds are high, flurbs are low, squares are low. Squares are low, diamonds are high. Squares are also high. In case you're really unimaginably stupid, I'll tell you explicitly that with the 10 card terminip rules, you choose 10 cards. 10, not 3. Last time it was 3, this time, 10. Get it? Even though we played 3 cards this time, we do 10 cards this time. I hope you can understand that, that you can get it through your thick eye call links call. All right, let's go. Three, two, one, so on. Let go. I think this one, this one, this one. I don't even know what the, all of them mean. Squares are high. That one, that one. I have no idea what I'm doing. That one. Ooh, done. I won again! Whoa, big surprise there! That was sarcastic, by the way. You may have been too moronic to realize, but I was just saying falsely that it was a big surprise, when in fact, it was not. I have an idea, though, to keep things interesting. One more round. If you win, then you get to leave here freely, and I will give you what you sought after when you came here. I'm trying to figure out if there's actually logic here. I don't see it. But if you lose, then not only will you be my slave, but I'm really not going to be nice to you at all. You'll do the hardest, most grueling, most painful jobs. 
and now constantly taunt you and tell you how pathetic you are. And you'll get the worst, most horrific tasting food, and you'll constantly be recorded with camera. And your image will be broadcast to my other minions to make them feel better about themselves and they will laugh at your misfortune. <laughs> and you'll be forced to wear headphones that constantly play sounds of nails on chalkboard. No! Your life will be hell and I'll use my fast wealth and knowledge to keep you alive forever and ever so you will never be able to escape. You'll live in unimaginable torment for eternity. You accept? You think you can win? Really? Your greed is astounding. Second round lost. I'll lose again. Can I even win? Let's talk to Mr. Cool Guy over here. What? I like you a lot. Teehee. You're better than all the others. I think you'll be my favorite to have around. Not that you'll have a choice. Dot dot dot. I'm really... Man, do I love... Do I ever love flesh? Yours looks so soft yet firm like a birthday cake that's filled with blood and arteries. Mm. Mm. I feel like the planets are aligned. You will be mine soon. Psst. Ooh. Hey. Hey, you. Ooh. Let me tell you something. Psst. Even though that fucker always goes on about and having no oh <laughs> yay! Even though that fucker always goes on about having no eyes is superior. He's full of shit. Clearly, my eyes are superior to his no eyes any day of this fucking week. Psst. That asshole pisses me off so much. Psst. Ooh, hey, psst. one more thing. Don't don't tell him I said that. Hee <laughs> Honestly, if you even win this round, then I don't really care. Your life is practically nothing to me. I have so many other minions beside you. Even if you could theoretically win, then you'd still have virtually no effect on my life. My superior brain and worldly power will still be unaffected, and that's all that ever matters. I always manage to get more people in servitude when I want, so I don't care anymore. I'm bored, you're boring, you don't do much. Mon cards is so simple of a game that it's not very stimulating for me. And taunting can only be fun for so long. I tried to make playing with you less boring by adding the extra round, but this is taking too long so maybe I made the wrong choice. So I'll stop talking so we can just get the game over with. And then I can move on to something else more entertaining. Yawn, yawn, yawn. Man, I'm bored. I shouldn't have come up with this last round. I'd rather be watching TV right now. Let's get this over with. Same rules, blah, 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 whatever. Let's start. 3, 2, 1, go. Am I winning? Done, finally. Maybe I can move on to something less boring soon. Alright, I win. I'm so shocked. You not only lost the best two out of three, but you also lost the extra round. How pathetic. Well, you're mine forever now. That was fairly fun and entertaining, right? I had fun. It dragged a bit towards the end, though. Well, at least I have you to own for the rest of eternity. That should provide some entertainment for me. Hmm. No. So I could actually win if I knew what to do. Wait. Oh, no. It isn't. Is it? That's back on the card. It can only mean one thing. The elephant! Whoa. What's happening? <laughs> no! Oh my god, no! How could this be? No, no, god, no! No, 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 no! Anything but this, I, I can't believe what's happening! No, 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 no! Please, don't look at me. I'm ashamed. <laughs> that was a nice game, that was a good ending. Uh, I like playing this, so I hope you enjoyed this game and this video, like if you did. Well, thank you all for watching, I'll see you next time, bye! Lots of seagulls go up and more there's the bar i'm in the clouds seagull king <laughs>